So you're creating a game and you want to add a pause menu. I will show you how to add a pause menu in Unreal Engine 5. Extremely easy. So let's get started. Let's go to our content browser and then right click and we will go down, scroll down if you don't see it, check user interface and click on widget blueprint. And here we will choose user widget. Okay. Now we will call this blueprint W pause, just like that. Okay. And then save everything. Double click on it and you will have the widget canvas. So the first thing is that here we will put all our elements. We will put a canvas. And there you go. You have your canvas panel here. And now what you need to do is to add a text here. And let's just move it here. Okay. Change the size and put the size to content here so that our widget is the size of my text. Okay. Just put it a little bit higher. I don't know, like 48 should be like a nice size. Okay. And then let's change the text. So it says pause and the anchor will be in the center. Okay. And then we will change the font family to have something more elegant. Let's change instead of bold, let's put light. And then compile. And that's it. That's our pause menu. Okay. So we need to add this pause menu into our level. So we're going to do that very easy. We're just going to our level. And here in blueprints, we will choose open level blueprint. And here I will put in event begin play, I will drag this and then cre create widget. Okay. And we will select the class, uh, I believe is W pause. Okay. There you go. Okay. And let's play it. So if we play it, nothing will happen is because we create a widget, but we haven't added to the screen. So in order to do that, we need to put something like add to viewport. Okay. And let's compile play. And there you have it. Now you have your pause menu and it's appearing when we don't make pause, but we will fix it in a second. The second thing I want to use is to put a blur in the background. So I will type blur here and I will put it here below to my canvas panel and I will blur it. So if I will put something like five or 10, okay. It will be here. Uh, and I will put the anchor to be the whole screen and I will put the offset to zero and zero. Okay. Now I have my blur. Let's see how it looks like. Now everything looks very blurry and it's a little bit too much. But also my pause is getting blurred too. I cannot read it. So let's go to our pause menu. Let's go to our background blur. And let's put the blur strength to five. And the pause, let's type C here. And this is the C order. We're going to put it to one so that we can, it can be on top of the blur. And then let's play from here. And there you go. That's your pause menu. That doesn't pause, so we will fix this now. Let's go to our blueprint. And here, uh, we need a button to add to viewport. So let's put keyboard and press P. So maybe this one, okay. So when press, we're going to add to viewport. So we're going to create a variable here. Let's put, uh, promote to variable and this will be my pause widget. Okay. And we will put it here. Now this add to viewport, we don't need. And now here on P we will drag our pause widget, put a get, and then here add to viewport. Okay. So let's try it out. If it works, go here, press P. And I add to viewport and it's not exactly pausing. So what we're going to do is to put remove from parent 
when we press P again. And in order to do that, we're going to add a flip flop. So let's go here and put flip flop. And this will say do A and then do B. And then when you finish B, do A again. So the first time I press it, add to viewport. The second time, remove from viewport. Okay. Let's play again. Press P. Okay. I have it. Press P again. I don't have pause. Great. Now what I need to do is to add pause. And it's extremely easy. You can just put pause set game paused and here we will put like check yes it is pause and then here we will control c control v and now here is not pause okay so let's put it here let's play p and our game is pause and then press p again and notice that i can't get out of the pause button and the reason is i'm in pause so how do we fix this we first need to go to our blueprint and here in p we need to make sure that you can execute when pause okay and just like that now we have our widget so let's go here play from here and let's play and then press p and we have our pause button i cannot move or anything press p again and that's it our pause menu is working perfectly all right, so this is how you can add pause menus to Unreal Engine 5. If you like this video, give us a like, subscribe for watch more videos like this. And of course, make sure to check our website to check some freebies. You have some amazing course to intro the blueprints and a lot of tutorials that can be very helpful to you. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.